How's it going guys? Dre here and welcome back to the Leaf Apartment in Grounded. Today, I think we're gonna take a little bit of a break from building and I wanna do some more exploring. You guys have told me of some cool key places to go to. Uh, there's a lot of secrets on this map that we haven't unlocked yet and hopefully we can find some new tools and whatnot uh, because there's still so much of this wonderful world to explore. So yeah, I've been thinking I definitely wanna build more of this. Ultimately, I'd like to have this as a tower where I can, you know, basically fly to any part of the map. I think it's kind of in the middle. It's a really good place for that, but it's not a really good spot for a base Now I could obviously wrap the perimeter with some spike traps and uh, Probably have this as a decent base But it would take a lot of upkeep as the animals are attacking more and more as you can clearly see I have so many worker parts and yeah It's just a very big base to defend when I'm playing alone if you don't know you can play this game with people as well. If I had people to kind of help me repair, I don't think it'd be so bad, but I do want to explore a little bit in this game as well. And, uh, yeah, lately I've been trying to defend this base basically 100% of the time. For this episode, I want to build the ant club today. Uh, we should definitely have enough ant parts to do this. Oh, damn it, you know what? I only looted one mandible, so I'm gonna have to go, uh, soldier ant hunting to get another one, because I do need two. That's fine. Um, we've dealt with them before. We can deal with them again. So I guess we'll hit the spider caves first, or sorry, the ant caves and then we'll start exploring this very large world now I didn't show you guys this but right by my base my base is um, right over here there's an ice camp caps mint cooler and I thought nothing of it but one of you said I could possibly get inside uh, I just had oh mint oh okay oh my god I can open it up <laughs> it's physics based I didn't expect that now if I pummel this mint Oh, it takes a tier two tool, doesn't it? Oh, now I must get the tier two tools. All right, there's one right there. Took him by surprise. Okay, he's going in the water <laughs> a little bit. So yeah, this is the only anthill I've found. It's supposed to be abandoned. I guess these guys were kind of left here. I'm not gonna complain. Did I get an ant mandible there? Yes, I did. Now I may as well try and grab a few more while I'm here. Oh, I'm fighting two at once here. Oh, this is getting dangerous. Okay, didn't expect to see two here. Stamina's low. Thankfully, oh god, this acorn armor is amazing. Oh, I'm so glad I made this early on, because I don't know if I'd be able to deal with that. <gasps> what the heck? I came back here. A scab scheme? Scab bugged? I'm so glad I saw that, it's so small. Okay, so now we got the giant ant club. Let's see how this thing is. I wonder if I can equip the torch at the same time. No, it's a two-hander. So, ooh, that's annoying because I, I expect to be going cave diving today. It's even glowing a little bit. Did you see that? Um, but unfortunately, I can't equip my torch. So I'm gonna need both of these weapons now. We really need a bigger backpack because I'm, <laughs> I'm holding a lot of weapons now. So first thing I wanted to check out, some of you guys commented that there's a, an underwater cave around Rash somewhere. Uh, that'd be fantastic. There's spoiled meat here for me killing all those damn gnats. Um, so yeah, ooh, it's a little dark. Can I, I wonder if I can use the torch underwater. Let's see what's sneaking around here. Okay, I'm not gonna question it. So... Oh my god, it's right here. God, that is huge, too. Okay, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Please tell me there's air. Oh god. I'm so dead! Oh, thank god! Jesus Christ! Way to horrify me. That's- that's the worst, like, drowning to death. But, already we're getting into some interesting stuff today. What the hell is that? Oh god, is there something in here? Why do I have my spear still? I just realized I still have this. You know what? We're just gonna drop that. Because I prefer my blade a little bit. So... Is this- Oh my god, is it a- <laughs> Didn't I say at episode one, I hope there's a four-leaf clover? Is there something special with this one? I can't even kill it! It's an unkillable four-leaf clover. <laughs> oh, there's nothing else? I was hoping I could, like, take the clover and make, like, I don't know, an umbrella out of it or something, or maybe a new way to fly? That would have been really, really cool. Maybe I need tier two tools? I don't know, but that's actually amazing. Can I get up there? No. All right, so the other thing while we're at this side of the map, I hear a lot of people talking about the secrets of the hedge. There's a, a lot of interesting stuff there. I haven't explored it too much. Uh, I did in the last episode. Sorry, actually the one before that because we did the building in the last episode. 
Um, and I saw there was, uh, one of those research bases in, like, the trees. Uh, well, I guess technically it's a hedge. Gotta remember, I'm so small, though. It feels like trees. So, yeah, I thought we'd go back over there, see what we can find. There's obviously lots of creatures and stuff around here that are dangerous, so I feel like if there's gonna be any secrets, um, there's good. it's gonna be kind of around here. So, yeah, I've never been in it. Oh, oh my god. Okay, oh god. Okay, you know what? I don't care about you guys. I wanna get some more beetles, because they actually got parts I need. Oh my god, he just spit the hell out of me. Come on, buddy. I don't think I've killed one, have I? Maybe just one. Oh yeah, this this ant thing is great. I just gotta watch my stamina. <laughs> These guys are working with me now. That's right, that was totally calculated. There we go, cut the beetle down. And uh, these are gonna be some great parts for later, so I may as well collect them while I'm here. All right, uh oh. Oh, it's just, it's just one of you. I'm not too worried about that. Okay, but that's what I was talking about. I saw that. Now there's gotta be, I can see junk at the top over here. So I'm thinking we gotta kinda try and climb this place. Uh, well, all right. That's some there. sort of interesting thing. The oh my, oh, oh, what the frick? I thought that was just an army of ants. I mean, what the hell? It's an army of dead ants. Oh, oh, what is it, search? <gasps> and more ant heads. I mean, I could use those. So, who the hell was an ant slaughterer? Oh god, this is like some demon crap here. Um... Oh. Well, that must be them, and would you look at that? I got a rotten ant club. Uh, I have so many questions right now. Who is this guy? Why did he die? I mean, he was clearly good at killing ants. I can actually loot these ant parts, too. What the hell did I just stumble upon? Oh my god, there's another cave. Oh my, is that a science thing? This is literally, I just jumped down from the other area. And is this, oh, it's locked. You bastard. Okay, so I don't wonder if that's locked because it's not out yet or what? Oh, there's a berry right here, sick. So I can see if I can get these things. Of course I can't jump and reach it. So let's just waste an arrow here. See if I can maybe knock them down. Not with arrows, maybe I need rocks. Or maybe I have to shoot the stem. Is it that accurate? It, oh my god, it is. <laughs> All right, now I have to smash the berry with, it looks like an ax. Okay, <laughs> I can't believe I had to get the stem. Oh, chopping tool, isn't this a chopping tool? Yeah, there we go, oh my god. So, you, I don't know if you noticed that, but you swing slower in the water. So I, it wasn't considered a chopping tool because it was too slow, I guess? So I had to actually bring the berry out of the water, but that gave me the leather. Or sorry, it gave me berry chunks. A rich, juicy, and utterly toxic berry do not consume. All right, can we get up to the bird feeder now? Well, maybe I think we can get up to the bird feeder from that uh, branch there. We definitely got to go up into the trees. There's so much stuff in there, guaranteed. Looks like we can get up right here. Perfect. There's also a cord. Cord tells me power, so there's got to be some sort of station up here. Question is, am I going to kill myself trying to get to it? There's a juice box up that way. Generally, if there's a point of interest, you should go that way. So let's go around. Well, we found this at least, the field station. That was easy to get to. And I can probably ID those berries now to figure out how to get berry leather. Never mind, I can make a berry chair. That is living large right there. Um, also, these explosive glands and things that I got, I can ID as well. So that might, might give me more armor, hopefully, or maybe a weapon. That'd be great. And I already knew the ant club. Explosive gland. I wonder... I wonder if we can make explosives. All right, so yeah, it's just more stuff stuff. Not really what I'm interested in. Man, you can't make bombs in this game. That's no fun. Oh, talk about lucky. I mean, I, I was just going. Let's kill this guy. There we go. Goodbye, spiderling. Thank you for the spider silk. But I think I made it to the bird feeder. Is there anything up here? This would be a great spot for a base if I wasn't e easily lost. Uh, looks like I can connect to more up here. And we got lots of berries, obviously. Free berry. Nothing in here, though. All right, well, that's fine. I think we can continue possibly this way. I just want to keep following the branches here, the big ones. Oh, it's like blocked in. There's like a wall of leaves here. So is this it? Um, obviously lots of berries around here. Let's see if there's anything connected over to this. Oh God, this is horrifying. <laughs> I love it though. Yeah, it looks like this is like a wall. You can tell. This definitely looks different from the other stuff, so. I didn't explore all of it, though. Oh, I'm stuck on the freaking leaf. This is a 
This is weird. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I just took fall damage. Oh, easy now. Okay, so yeah, I didn't explore all of it. Actually, what the hell is that? Wait. Is that a... What the hell? Oh my god, there's a freaking tunnel. Please tell me I can get in. Is this the one? No, this is not the one I found because it was on a wall. This is locked as well. How did I get up here? Okay, so I was by the bird feeder and I flew down. I think I'm on the top hedge is what I'm at right now. I wonder if I should build like a sleep place here. It looks like this might even open up over here. Problem is it's getting so late. So if I could make a base, that would be great. Fortunately, I need clover leaves and um, sprigs. Kind of hard to come by up here. So I think I'll come back. I kind of know the way I came. If I start early in the day, I should be able to find this pretty easily. There's got to be a way to get into that base. All right, day two, here we go. I'm gonna go out back to the hedge right away so we get enough time to hopefully explore that base. Um, yeah, I'm not too worried about my base right now. It's being attacked, yes. Um, I do need to fortify it. Do I not? Oh, thank God I have a slurp juice here. Oh, that's a double, perfect. Um, that does give me food, by the way, too, which is fantastic. Oh, another one. This is why I love my juice box. I have a quest to explore Plank Cliff. This is a plank. I don't know if it's necessarily a cliff. There it is! Oh, talk about lucky. Um, okay, I know where this is. I should probably be able to get these pretty easily. Uh, plant fiber, sprig, and clover leaf. So, um, problem is there's a spider right underneath me. All right, let's try that again. Oh god, big spider. I haven't fought one of these yet, and I don't really want to today. They're like <laughs> giant tarantulas. The yellow ones aren't bad. Don't know how those are gonna be though. They're about twice the size. Uh, of course I need one sprig. God damn it. Ooh, is that a cave? Oh my god! No, that's not a cave. They Jesus Christ. Ah! God damn it! No! No! I, got, I ran away from a spider into a bigger spider. That's not what you want to do. All right, but I did it. So that's done. At least we're getting some science points today as well. Ah, and we got 100 for that. I don't know if that was worth it or not. So there's the hedge. We're close to it. Let's head back over there. All right, wait for him to pass. That was not waiting for him to pass. Hope you don't see me, buddy. This ain't dangerous at all. God damn it. I can't believe I survived that. Maybe this isn't the way you're supposed to go. I keep hitting my head off something. Uh, well, I could definitely fly there, I think. So let's just do that. I wonder if I need to stay up, though. Shoot. Because I can definitely stay up there. Now that I saw it. Oh, my God. There's just, like, two chilling there. This is clearly a place they don't want you to go. At least easily, what the hell? Oh, Jesus, how'd you see me? Usually you guys are freaking blind, which is surprising considering you got eight eyes. Damn it. Oh, Jesus, I'm gonna have to kill this guy. All right. Oh my God, you're a fast one. Orb Weaver. Okay, smaller, but horrifying. So yeah, I'm thinking the part that I jumped down on, maybe I'm supposed to stay on because it doesn't look like I can use these mushrooms. Oh my God, there's so many just chilling here. I can probably get up here. Of course, like the part where all the spiders are. All right, I'm just, I'm just running. I'm just running. Sorry, guys. Sorry for invading your home. I don't think they can get up here. What the? Oh, please tell me. Please. Oh, it's locked. Come on, just let me climb it. There's so much to this area. I might be able to get up over here, maybe? I don't know. This ain't looking good. No, you know what? I can see that's where I need to go. That freaking part that I jumped off of. Yep, that's definitely the way to go. All right, what's up, dude? Oh, man, freaking orb weavers. Oh, I stunned him. This thing's amazing. Thank God for the stun. It uses so much freaking stamina, though. I'm gonna see if I can block him. There we go. Get him. There we go. Okay, got some spider venom. I don't think I've gotten spider venom yet, so that's awesome. Um, Crap, what do I do here? I don't want to jump down and be able to not get back up. So it looks like I can go down over here. Uh, let's go this way. Let's just check all the ways. There's a can or something out here. <gasps> oh, don't fall. Don't fall. Oh my god. Okay, jump back on. Whew. This is dangerous. There we go. What the hell is this? H D P. What the? Oh, what the? Uh. Okay. I got another scab. Well, this is a great view. I want this to be my freaking base now. Wait, wait. I'm locked in, dude. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I got locked in there. All right, well, now I need to look everywhere 
Because we have this giant base, but we also got these little secret things. I wonder if I can climb these. Oh god, I don't want to do that now because I'll definitely fall. I'm gonna jump back down to here. This is amazing. This is such a smart idea to have the hedge have so much crap in it. Because it's so easy to get lost. Now obviously we got the main base. I don't know how to get into it though. There's got to be a way to get in. Found another way to get up. Is there anything up here of interest? Oh my god, there's another one. Okay, so there's the base. Please tell me this one isn't locked. Oh my god, it's not! How many of these friggin' places is there? Ooh, this one's bigger. Is this all placeholder for now, or is there actually part things to do here? I mean, clearly they're using some major power to do something here. Story, strange note. Check other labs for evidence of the Watcher. What does that mean? I, well, I got something at least. There, <laughs> there's some sort of lore with this. Uh, obviously we got some sort of satellite dishes in here. Can we get into the other base though? Obviously these ones are cool, but this one is freaking mammoth. Uh, is that broken? Hold on. Oh, oh, Jesus. Okay, the spider saw me. Uh, you think I can make that? That's obviously a way in. Oh, yes, I got it. I, th I thought I missed it. Oh my god. Guys, I got in the freaking base. Oh, and you can actually get through. Is there any actual entrance? Holy crap, man. Oh, there's got to be some stuff in here for sure. I got a log. Supplemental log, ominous practical technologies. Totally. Go, oh, whatever. I'll sort it later. The important thing is, I have done it! Success! The spacer has worked its magic! I'm assuming that's I why we're small. I shrunk a set of basic plastic polyhedral dice from the size of standard dice to no bigger than the size of... Well, much smaller dice. Okay, so obviously there was some sort of scientist that did indeed shrink us. I'm not seeing much else here. Mind you, this is a very big place. Hey, buddy. You can't get me. This feels great. Keep going down. I don't think I've been all the way down here. It's getting dark out, as you can see, so I got rid of my torch for the time being because I might need it. That's an entrance. I hope it's locked. Okay, so that is definitely locked. He's trying to get in. So at least I know where the start is, so I'm going to check through this once again. I feel like this is definitely something. It's glowing. It's making a noise. The thing is, I'm questioning, is this part of the game yet? Am I supposed to be here? Oh, man. Is this a corridor that I even looked at? I'm easily lost. Oh no, okay, this is the main analyzation chamber. So we got more of those things. What the hell? Close what? What What did I close? Okay, that's locked. So this has got to be the main hub. We just have an analyzer here I can't do anything with. What did I just... What did that lever do though? It didn't even make a noise! All right, unfortunately, I gotta get going. Um, it was right here, right? Yeah. So, I know how to get back in. I'm very curious about what the hell that lever possibly did. The fact that it said nothing or made no sounds kind of creeps me out. But as you can see, it's dark out right now. I gotta get going home, uh, cause I'm hungry as well. So, I think that was a good amount of exploration though. Maybe this is unlocked now? That would be amazing if it is. No, it's still locked, so it didn't, like, unlock all these other areas that I'm finding. The question is, did I, like, reach the end of this early access version? Like, what the hell? I have so many questions now. What, I, I wonder if those things turned on these lights, because I don't remember. Like, I've been out at night. I don't remember these lights being on before, though. So did that unlock something new? Uh, oh, also... You guys wrote, let me know that these are the larvas that I need, or the grubs, rather. Good timing there. Thank you, mister. So, yes, now I know how to get the grubs as well, and grub goop and all that fun stuff, so we can research that and see what that unlocks as well. What a day, man. That was probably the most eventful day in this game yet. And I think that's a good time to wrap up this one here, guys. We did pretty much exclusively exploration today. And I think I'll, that's what I'll do. I'll kind of have a mixture. I'll do a build episode and then maybe an exploration episode. I don't know how much more 
uh, secrets there are on this very large map. Well, small but large, you get the idea. But yeah, it feels like every corner I go to, there's something new. So I definitely want to explore some more, but in the next one, I want to get a good base going on. At least something that I can um, fortify. I don't know if I, like I said, I don't know if I want to fortify this one. It's just so big, I'd have to build a perimeter all the way around it. So I think we'll have this as like a teleport tower. Something that hopefully we can build to the sky and fly everywhere on the map. And then have a base somewhere in... Maybe, what the, oh, that was a fly, it scared the hell out of me. Get the hell out of here. But yeah, then we'll have like maybe a cave base somewhere. I'm thinking that cave with the ant heads? I don't know, I feel like that'd be a great base because it's right by the hedge as well, which is clearly a great place, place for these berries. By the way, did they do anything yet? No, so I gotta figure out how to turn berry chunks into berry leather. There's still a lot we can do, obviously, and I'm enjoying this game so damn much, and I hope you guys are as well. So yeah, as always, thanks for watching and liking, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.